I spy with my little eye. Actually, I don't think I'll bother. Actually, I think I can see something, sir. Really? Where? Could it be a friendly recovery vehicle has come to our aid? Or possibly a supply truck filled to the brim with life-saving aid? It's a desert rat, sir. Oh, thank heavens! Monty sent the 7th Armoured out to rescue us. How many tanks? It's not in a tank, sir. It's just sort of scurrying around in front of the left track. Corporal? Yes, sir? It's a gerbil, isn't it? Yes, I'm, a I'm afraid it is, sir. Brilliant! I am starving! Let's have a look at the little fella, shall we? Oh yes, I see the little hairy blighter. Reckon you can pop him from here with the two-pounder? I'll see what I can do, but it's been three days since we last ate, and frankly, everything is beginning to get, you know, a little bit wavy, sir. And, well, I suppose being lost in the world's largest desert, in the world's smallest and most uncomfortable tank, doesn't help either. Oh, hang on. Tease up. Oh, good. You see, we have to be grateful for the small mercies. And, Harris, how long before you get this fine tank of ours moving? Oh, well, uh, that depends. Once uh, Fuzzy's made a generous personal donation to the water tank, and I've reworked some plumbing, I think we'll be on our way. Oh, jolly good. Though this is, in fact, a brilliant ambush position, it is a rather exposed place to overheat and break down. Sir, I've spotted something, sir. It's not Vera Lynn, naked and covered in marmalade again, is it? I keep telling you, Fuzzy, they're just mirages. They're not real. Mmm... No. It's got more of an aircraft sort of feel to it. An aircraft? Oh, really? You know, Fuzzy, sometimes you really are a complete and utter f- Hang on! Right. Uh, everybody remain calm. I have just spotted an aeroplane flying around. Ooh, is it one of ours? Well, it's bound to be. Headquarters must have sent it out looking for us. Only question is, how do we send out a distress signal? We could try some flares. I don't see what changing the cut of our trousers has to do with anything. No, 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 I've got a better idea. Why don't we flash our headlights at him? Yes, we could use Morse code. Right, Harris, on my command. And, uh, go. Yes, and again. Yes. Oh, he spotted us. He's turning around. Oh, bravo. Thank God. Oh, yes, he's flying straight towards us. Oh, yes. He is rather low, isn't he? And fast. You know, it's... Funny, I, I didn't know we had any three-engined aircraft in service. Three... three engines, you say? Doesn't sound like a familiar type. It's a Fokker. He's a Fokker, all right, but he's flying an Italian aircraft. Well, whose side is he on, then? Well, uh, what year is it? Well, it's 1941. Right, then. Ahem! <laughs> Forward, driver! Is everybody okay? Oh, it's everywhere. What is it? Is there a fire? Uh, oh, oh great, sir. Uh, oh, all over the driver's console. Dear God! Anything else? Uh, there's a chip out of the teapot and... Oh, yeah, yes, the track's come off. Right! Well, you'd best fix it, then. Uh, you're not wrong there. Anyone got any glue? This is prized china. Ooh, I think I see a mirage. Oh, yes. Oh, well, look at that. That one, this is fantastic. That one looks just like a convoy of German tanks. God, it's very lifelike, isn't it? Yes, it's incredibly convincing, isn't it? Yes, well, it must be a mirage. I, I don't think the Germans have that many tanks. Look at the gun on the front of that one. That can't be real. Good God, no, look at the size of it. No. You know, this mirage is so believable, I can actually hear it. We must all have incredibly vivid imaginations to see all this. And we're absolutely sure the German army doesn't have this many tanks. Why, I'm absolutely sure. And to put your mind at rest, Fuzzy, put one through that imaginary one at the front. Right you are. I'll aim for the biggest one. There's no harm in it since it's obviously not really there. On its way! <laughs> Ha! Harris? Yes, sir? Put the teapot repair to one side for just a moment, and uh, get us moving very quickly. Fuzzy? Yes, sir? You'd best break out the emergency biscuits. We're gonna need them. We'll keep a solid eye on what's going on from the turret whilst Harris is repairing the track. Hang on, I've got something.
How's the repair coming along, Harris? Right, that's done. I'll start her up. Harris! What have you done to my tank? It, it won't start. Oh, for the love of all that's holy! Right, time for a weaselly ruse. Harris, break open the crates marked Ruddy Convincing Camouflage and see what you can do. Fiendish! Right, they're close. Act natural. Fuzzy, have a look through the right-hand vision slit. Uh-huh. How's it looking? Are they gone? Not exactly, no sir. In fact, I think they might have spotted us. But how? We're camouf- Oh, wait. Look. They're painted yellow. Oh, clever. I wish we'd thought of that. Come out with your hands up. Not on your Nelly. Fuzzy, give them everything you've got. Everything? What, the machine gun as well? This is madness. I think I'm going to faint. Yeah, it's pretty exciting, isn't it? Fire! Wait a second. What, sir? Those black bars at the top and the bottom of the screen. What are they? Oh, they add tension. All the movies do it now. Get rid of them. It looks silly. Anyway, fire! Fire! I think they schießen auf uns. <laughs> That's the spirit, Harris! Well, that's a bit of a pisser. Yep. An alle Panzer, Feuer frei nach eigenem Ermessen. Well, that was a stroke of bloody good fortune. Typical. You had to say it, didn't you, you wank? <laughs>